I'm Mike Kaiser and we're on the fifth tee of the Lido. is our newest golf course, uh, one that we're restoring that was lost in 1941. It was originally designed by C.B. McDonald and, and built in 1917 on Long Island, uh, and we're restoring it here in Wisconsin. It, it sort of follows the narrative of the lost city of Atlantis, right? It was this fabulous golf course that everybody agreed was, you know, in elite status, you know, and there was a lot documenting what it was with photography and drawings from C.B but I think that contributes a lot to the allure. So super high quality, you know, lost, and it begs the question, what was it, what made it so great? Tom Doak, who is restoring the course with Renaissance Golf, has been a skeptic of the idea for 20 or 30 years. I mean, he didn't think that there was enough information to get it exact. We replicated the cardinal direction of the layout from its original origin on Long Island, and, and then we checked the wind. There's something called a wind rose, and it shows the velocity and direction or frequency of the wind. And, and we got it for Long Island, we got it for Rome, Wisconsin, and they were almost exact. And had they not been, we probably wouldn't have built the golf course because the wind is such an integral uh, part of the, de the design. Peter Flory has been accumulating uh, as much in in historical data on the course as, as anybody on the planet. Building that into a computer model outsourcing that and when people see it and they have a hidden uh, bit of data they've been sending it to them so that that when Tom reviewed what Peter had accumulated he changed his position and said we can you know do this uh, very accurately and, and almost exactly you know what what makes an elite course is no duds you know a really strong base and then some really high notes to me the Cape is one of them we started on two. I, I love I love that golf hole. See the pin in the in the green. It's a plateau right of it. Huge front pinnable area. It's back in a big back pinnable area. Huge left plateau. So this is double plateau. And then water long. The the channel hole and the 18th designed by Alistair McKinsey are are two of the most unique holes uh, out here and will really stand out. So those those are four of them, but. Uh, there's eight or nine that are, are, are really pop out and, and I can't wait to play every one of them.